Welcome back. In this video, we'll talk about the rash of the newborns. Red lesions most commonly affect the face. The most common is nevus simplex. These are blanching pink patches that gradually fade over time. They can occur anywhere in the body, but commonly affect the forehead or the neck. And if the lesion was less diffuse and sharply defined, this is likely hemangioma. These lesions tend to be raised and very red. They usually increase in size and then decrease. Beta blockers can be used in some cases to help the regression. On the other hand, if the lesion was more diffuse, involving half of the face, without passing to the other side, so on only one side of the face, this is likely nevus flammus, and is commonly referred to as port wine stain. These lesions are more reddish than nevus simplex, and they do not regress with time. And if the lesion was brown or black, this is likely a melanoma, and they most commonly occur in the back. If it was only one lesion in one site, this is likely congenital melanocyte nevus. These tend to be raised with hair on top of them. They're mostly benign and do not require any further investigation. And if there was diffuse patches here and there that are blue grayish in color, this is likely congenital melanocytosis. We see this mainly in Asian and African American children. And if there were many different hyperpigmented patches here and there, this is likely cafe au lait. We see this in McCorn Albright syndrome and neurofibromatosis. Alright guys, that's all I have. Thank you so much for watching and hopefully this helps.